Hey, welcome to another guitar lesson. It's been a while since I've done one, but now uh, we have a new guitar and a better video quality. So hopefully that will improve your uh, learning experience. Uh, we are looking at how to play Home by One Direction. It's from their new album and it's pretty easy to play. It's uh, only three or four chords and we're in open standard tuning and no capo required for the song. And the opening um, intro Go something like this. Alright, and you repeat it one more time and then you start with the verse. If you don't want to learn this, you can skip straight to the verse, but we're gonna learn this how to play first. Uh, you want your sixth string open. Okay, and I'm playing it with my thumb. And I'm playing the fourth string, fourth fret with my index finger. You play both of them together and at the same time you want to do a hammer on from 4 to 6 on the 4th fret. Alright? And then again you want to play 4 and 6. Okay, I'm just doing it with my index finger for now. Up, down. So you get... And then one more time the hammer on and the sixth string open again so you have all right one more time and then you want to do okay so this is the ending uh, here we do up 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 down up on the same uh, sixth fret of the fourth string okay so Right, so one more time, the whole thing. Up, up, down, up. Okay. You can also do it with a pick if you want. And then the next time what you want to do is. Okay, so what we're doing is the beginning is the same. Okay, this is the same. Um, but the next time. When you do the hammer on, you move from 4 to 7. Alright, so 4 to 7 instead of 4 to 6. Okay, so you have. Like this. Okay, one more time. Okay, and then up, 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 down, up on the 7th fret. Okay, so you're repeating the same right hand. Alright, just that during the second time, uh, in the end, you want to do a hammer on from 4 to 7. So now from the very beginning, you get this. Up, 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 down, up, and then. Up, 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 down, up. You can actually do this. You can do up, 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 down, up. On the last up stroke, you can go back to the sixth fret, one fret down. Okay, this is what I, what I do as well when I played it in the very beginning. I did this, uh, so 
if you play it from the very beginning again, you get this. Up, 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 down, up. Up, 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 down, up. Okay? Up, 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 down, up. Alright? So. Up, 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 down, up. Up, 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 down, up. And again. And then you go to the verse of the song. Right? So let's see how the verse goes like. So for that you need your 6th string open, 5th string, 2nd fret with your middle finger, 4th string, 2nd fret, ring finger, and 3rd string, 1st fret. These are open. Alright, now let's look at the strum pattern. That's the strum pattern over there. You got down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Alright? One more time. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Okay, so. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Again. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. And then you move to A chord. Okay, so for that you need these three fingers on the second fret of the fourth, third, and second strings. Fifth string is left open and you play from the fifth string. Okay, you don't play the sixth string. same on A major as well. You can do it with a pick if you want and then go back to E. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Okay, so from the very beginning. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, 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 back to E. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Then again. a little change that you can do in the end uh, for the E major a little improvisation okay now with that it would sound like that okay so that's the little improvisation in the very end okay when you go A and then you go back to E you can do down up, down, up, down. Then on the next down stroke, you can do a hammer on from the first to the second fret on the third string with your pinky finger. Alright, so down, down, up, down, up, down. Okay, you do a hammer on and then up, down, up. Then you release it, go back to E. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Okay, so you go to A, down, down, up, down, up, down. E, down, down, up, down, up. Now during the next down stroke, you do the hammer on. And then up, down, up. And you release it again, go back to E. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Okay, so we start from A. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. E, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down. Okay, that's improvisation. And then you repeat it one more time. That's the um, uh, verse over there. And after that, you go to pre-chorus of the song, right? That's uh, pretty sweet. You've got C sharp minor, okay? Okay, so that's, uh, you can just do a simple down strum, you know, just to practice the chord changes, okay? so. But if you go along with the strum pattern, then you can do it down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up on the C sharp minor chord. Okay, so you play it this way. You have a bar on the fourth fret, then you got fifth fret on the B string, 
and we've got a six fret and six fret again on the fourth and third strings right so and in the same string pattern down down up down up down up down up change to a major down down up down up down up down up and go to e major with the name D So let's take it from the beginning for the pre-chorus. One more time, the same thing. straight to the chorus of the song. That's the best part for the song. It goes like this. It's Here the strum pattern changes a bit. You can see uh, in the E major chord, I go up, down, up, down. Okay, and I just you know leave it on the down stroke. Let it ring the chord. So you go down, up, down, up, down. Alright, so one more time. Down, up, down, up, down. Four. Go to A major. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Go back to E. Down, up, down, up, down. Again, A. Down, down, up, down, up. To E. Down, up, down, up, down. So from the beginning for the chorus. Down, up, down, up, down. Four. Down, down, up, down, up, down. Up, down, up, down. Up, down, up, down. Down, 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 up. You know, that's another um, fill in that you can do um, when you transition to the A chord, right? So you go down, up, down, up, down. Down, 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 up. And then you go to e, A major. Down. Up down up down up down up down up down up down 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 up down down up down up down up down up down up down up down 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 up down down up down up down up down up and now comes the change down 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 up down 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 up down that's the ending of the chorus okay so in the very end you want to go to C sharp minor all right, and you want to do down, 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 up, and A, down, 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 up, make you feel like home, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, you know, then you go straight to the second verse of the song, all right, so one more time, the chorus, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, second verse the whole thing right same as the first verse uh, you go to the second pre-chorus after that same thing um, C sharp minor and A then E then you go to the second chorus of the song uh, just like the first one and after the second chorus you go again to the chorus and then you end the song you know so there's no really uh, not a bridge section where you change the chords or anything like that I mean you're just going on the second chorus when you're ending the second chorus I like this during the very end if you remember the chorus down 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 up down 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 up right one more time up down up down up down up and then you go to the chorus again this is the final chorus it's so Yeah.
variation that we talked about. That marks the end of the song. So, um, like I said, you've got the verse, the first verse, the first pre-chorus, then you go to the chorus, you repeat the same thing for the second verse, second pre-chorus, then you go to the chorus, and after the chorus, you go again to the final chorus, and you just play the same thing. That marks the end of your song. Alright, so that is it for this guitar lesson. I hope you liked it. If you want, if you're performing this, you know, live, um, you're doing a cover, then you can actually end the song like this. You know, you can end the song by playing the same intro that we played in the intro, obviously. You know, you can repeat that during the very end of the song and you can end that way, so it will sound nice. Alright, so that is all for uh, this lesson. I hope you liked it. If you did like it, then please make sure uh, to subscribe to my channel if you haven't, if you're new. And uh, for more One Direction songs, you can check out the playlist that I have uh, in my channel. I've done lots more One Direction songs, so hopefully you will like them. And I will see you guys next time. Make sure to give this video a like if you enjoyed it. And we'll talk later. Bye-bye.